movie involving departed band members, and I don't, I don't like to talk trash about people. Right. <laughs> we've had some amusing arguments. Yeah, it gets very Spinal Tap, you know? <laughs> uh, we were Spinal Tap from the start, before we'd even sold a record. It was amazing. You know, it was like, mm, uh, I thought I asked for a hotel room with a bath in it, not a shower. You know, that kind of stuff, which was quite, quite amazing. Before we'd even, you know, put a seat on. anything. Fred the one you just met. Of, Fred zips in and out of dimensions, you know? <laughs> Sometimes he takes you, you with him as well, it's brilliant. We practically left him in Chelmsford yesterday. The bus was literally driving off site and he, we realized he wasn't on it. We, we managed to capture Future him. Dimension, we probably. had to put him in a net and drag him off the bus. I always pay for my Porn Max. <laughs> Those like wet wipes maybe, those are good. A travel guitar. Uh, I don't know. Sufficient socks. First gig we ever did outside of London was in uh, Stoke-on-Trent and there were about 12 people there and there were about five girls who were kind of into it and they're like uh, six blokes and one indiscriminate who was sort of standing in the middle and it was just yeah it was really bad I remember we didn't even hang around to get paid we were getting paid about 30 quid for the gig but because we got on and then I think they they, start, they started shouting out that we thought we were punks and they started sort of, uh, the blokes started booing, the girls were kind of into it and then about three something they realised that our Peruvian drummer could have been a packy so they started shouting packies and punks uh, so they didn't like us because we were... never heard this story, Yeah, 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 yeah. Stoke on trend so oh, man. Yeah, we were being called packies and punks and we didn't stay, we literally just sort of did the six songs and just ran into the splitter and got out of there. Yeah. Probably good. I'm sure Stoke on Trend has its moments as well. Yeah. It's like beer pong, I suppose. You get like a triangle of beer cups full of like, you know, a third a cup of yeah. beer, and there's it's like a, across a table. So you've got like a triangle shape and a triangle shape. And there's two opposing players, and you're trying to just firing ping pong, ping pong balls into <laughs> the beer. And if you get one in their cup, they've got to drink it. Oh, amazing. And you're just trying to just get them drunk. That's amazing. I mean, it's pretty basic, but it was good. Good game.